<laughs> that too. Okay, do you want to hear about beer slushies? Please. Beer slushy two words that you're going to love? Yes, moving on. Okay, perfect. Um, Virgin Beer Company, Ken, you're the man. You're going to have three different kinds of beer slushies. So this is the idea. I keep telling everyone there's grand openings of everything in San Diego because if you opened last year, you basically didn't get your grand opening. That's what you guys are doing at the Arbor. This is super cool. You're a Carlsbad-based um, brewing company that's now downtown. That's where we are. How on earth do you make a beer slushy? This thing's still freezing, by the way. You guys are like in the process, getting ready for the weekend. Absolutely. So we just take one of our famous beers. Okay. We mix it with either punch, mango, or strawberry. Those are our three flavors for Saturday. And secret concoction, secret mix. Obviously, we can't give out our recipes, <laughs> okay. but those are your flavors. And then we just put it in here, and hopefully it freezes in time. So this is kind of like a blue raspberry. Is that what's happening right. here? So does it taste like a 7-Eleven slushy, like a Slurpee? 100%. Okay. So you make sure you only have a few. Dangerous. Very dangerous. Okay, because my idea when I saw Mackenzie, uh, who we're going to meet just a minute, her and I were talking about beer slushies, and I'm like, that sounds like watered-down beer. That sounds like a horrible idea. But you guys have done your job, which is, you know, the brewing process and all that. Can I taste it even though it's not ready? Absolutely. I kind of need to. Oh, that is cool. Gonna get you in trouble. Okay, yeah, I see there's like all these producers and the guys behind the scenes and they're like, Heather, bring some of that back. <laughs> anyway, if um, if it's not ready and I can't bring it back, you gotta come out here on Saturday and try it out. Should I talk to Mackenzie about all the details in the party? Is that her? Details on the party, okay. all the merch that's coming out, it's gonna be a blast. We're opening at 11, get here early. So fun. So this is the new place called Virgin at the Arbor. Um, I love how every brewery is making merchandise now. Not only does it help you guys with sales and all of that, but it kind of is like notoriety. Like you walk around town and you're like, who's your brewer? I got it on my hat and my shirt, right? So Mackenzie, talk about these two new beers. They look pretty in the can, which obviously is already appealing, but they're actually really pretty when you pour them. Thank you, yeah. So we've got two exciting beers. They're actually releasing today. They'll be available all weekend long. Um, so come out, out for the grand and open, open those for us. Tell us about that one. This is Subtle Variants. It's our collaboration with Faction Brewing up in San Francisco. Fun. Super delicious. It's called a Strong Pale Ale. Easy drinking. A Strong Pale Ale. Yeah. What does that mean? So it's sort of like um, San Diego is famous for our West Coast IPAs yeah. and pale ales. Mm -hmm. This one is like a super easy drinking, crisp. It's got a lot of fruit notes. Okay. Um, and yeah, it looks just like an IPA. Yeah, it does, okay. but it's similar to those beer slushies, like it's super sneaky, really okay. easy to drink and it could get you into trouble. I feel like a lot of our brewers are doing like some sneaky things right now that I'm like, I'm okay. Yeah. All right, this one is the first of its kind. I want you to open that because I think it's yeah. a little not what people would expect. Juice land. Okay. So we uh, juiced this hazy IPA up with blueberry, oh, peaches, fun. vanilla, oh. and uh, it turned out this like purplish, cool. cool, delicious color. And are you doing like, is this, I mean, correct me if I'm wrong, but there's some people who are like barrel aging with like cherries and all these really interesting things that they're doing to make yeah. the flavors. So how are you guys making this one? Um, this, the fruit is added in after we sort of have the beer. Okay. So this is like a true beer. It's 6.6% .6 ABV. Okay. Then we add in the fruit after so that cool. you get this awesome nuance to it. Oh my gosh, so that cute. looks like a Friday. Where's Raul? Raul's like, you better bring one of those back to me. I'm like, we're going to get on the bike, Raul. And then this yeah, is happening right now afterwards. Um, by the way, cool merchandise. Hats so you've sweet. got some cool Padres yeah. kind of style gear. Oh, right. Did they let you steal the fryer or is I that mean, like a pseudo fryer? It's a pseudo fryer. Okay. Pseudo like we, fryer. you know, it's a virgin version of the fryer, okay. but yeah, we're super stoked to be really close to the park and the team is performing mm. exceptionally well. So we yeah. wanted to get some, uh, virgin the padre themed yeah. gear out there so i love that i was gonna say good for you guys if they said gave you the thumbs up because that's a hard one to grab um in the next hour by the way you guys we are going to talk about um some of the ways that they create all their tables in here because it's all like all the wood has a really cool story to it oh, so oh, if you stick oh, around with good. us and um, we're going to chat a little bit about that i know that's so really from cool. the tables to the chairs and then all of their yeah. other breweries like yeah, it's really cool and it's got some of it as like live edge. So if you're into all that stuff, um, we'll be able to tell you some of the stories behind their furniture, if you will. Should I try this one? Please oh, do. It looks really yeah, yeah. pretty. Try that one. What is that like? There's a lot of foam. I feel like I'm going to have like a foam <laughs> mustache going on here. That's the best kind of mustache I have. You'd figure after working in San Diego all these years, I'd have like, you know, good practice and technique, but um, that's good. That's it's, good. it's fruity, yeah. It literally yeah. tastes kind of blue, like a blueberry. Ooh. That's good. I like it. Blueberries. Happy Friday. That. Happy Friday. That's, this should be more interactive with that here. Yes. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Thanks, Heather.